Okay, I'm not really sure where I left off because it's been a while. Uh, so video two, this is just the way it goes, guys. Um, okay, so I copied and pasted image holder ID. Okay, pause the video and try to copy this. All right, I'll just change the content here. Usain to Bolt. Think of something clever. Fast. All right, good enough. Here's the design view. There it is. Okay. Next thing I'm going to do, I'm going to add another div tag. Okay. We're almost done with the uh, HTML coding. So we're going to insert. And let's see. Let me see. Let me see. Nope. We're going to go down to um, move this back up. So this is the big. Oh my gosh, that is so slow. All right, I'm wasting precious time here. So that's the content div, okay? Um, I'll put uh, the comment here, ending content. And then, you don't have to do this. I'm just letting you see that. Okay, um, it's good for me too. So I'm done with, the, with that, and so what I need to do is put, um, a big image below. So I'm going to get my cursor below and insert layout div tag. Come on, baby. All right, here we go. I'm sorry. This computer is slow as molasses. Okay, we're going to call this uh, BTM, capital I A M, or I M A G E. BTM for bottom image. I'm going to click OK and bingo. Okay. All right, let me see where I am. So I'm going to put this downward, okay? And let's see, did I do this right? Header, content, and that's the wrapper div. Okay, let's see, that's the image, image, okay. And, all right, this is not the ending of the content. This is the ending of the big frame, okay? This down here is the ending of the content, end content. Okay, just to be clear on that. So check your work. Okay, so, um, I want this to be before the content. This is going to be there too, okay? The big image, the bottom image rather, has to be before the end of the content, okay? Now, um, what we're going to do is add another div tag. And this one's going to be paragraph. This is where the quote goes in. So I'm going to do a layout, div tag, and I'm going to call this paragraph, okay? And it's going to be. Um, it's going to be a class, paragraph, and we don't want to capitalize it, paragraph. Okay, click OK. Okay, so you see it right there. Okay, so far so good. And then the footer is going to go right before the end of the wrapper. So the wrapper is right here. This is the end of the wrapper right here. Wrapper. Keep that in mind. So the footer just goes right uh, right inside, right below that. So let's go ahead, insert, layout, div tag, just call this an ID footer. Okay. Click OK. All right, we're going to now start writing code. Uh, sorry, we're going to start um, doing the CSS. So what we need to do is right here, um, actually right here, I'm going to go File, New, okay, and we're going to, we're going to um, make a CSS page. So go to CSS and make sure it's blank and create, okay, there it is. We're going to call this File, Save As. And make sure you save it into the right folder. Mine's going to go here, the Connie folder. I'm going to call this biography. 
uh, underscore bolt. I, you don't need the name uh, of the person. I just want to do that. Okay. And there it is. There's the CSS one. I'm going to go back into the code of my HTML. And you've got to put it in before the closing head tag. I'll just put it right underneath the title there. And I'll just drag it over. And I will save all. Okay. Now, let's get busy here. So there's no styles yet, so we're going to add our first one. Okay. And this is going to be the wrapper. And it's the ID. So I'm going to click it. And we're just going to crank this out, guys. Okay. So we're going to do background. And I'm just going to choose a, a gray. Okay. For now. Um, and let's do a box of 960 and width, uh, sorry, width of 960, height of 900, okay? And we're going to do auto left, auto right and auto left, okay? And I'm going to do a top margin of 5. Okay, I click OK. In there, I'm also going to put a box shadow. So, you see what I'm doing here? Box shadow. And I'm going to do 4 pixels PX, 4 pixels, that's the X and Y coordinate. I'm going to do 5, I'm going to do about 50 pixels, that's the blur. And I'm just going to do. Uh, Black, one, 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 and you only need three, three numbers for that. I'm going to save it, Command S, and let's preview this. Got to go to your HTML, preview it in Safari, <laughs> and what do we got here? Nothing. Apparently, um, my CSS is not actually attached. So I gotta see why. I'll have to pause the video. All right. Um, the reason why I didn't turn gray is because I didn't have the hashtag for wrapper. Okay. So make sure you put that hashtag in there. Okay. So I'm gonna refresh this, and we need a body. So this is gonna be a tag. We're gonna call it body, and we're gonna click OK. All right. I'm going to choose the background, and I'm going to go into Photoshop, choose uh, New, and I think all I'll do here is choose a Web 1280 by 1040, 1024 rather, click OK, and all I'm going to do is put a gradient in there. Okay, so I'm going to just use my linear gradient and drag it straight down. Um, matter of fact, I'm going to just change this a little bit. And um, yeah, maybe maybe that looks sort of uh, Jamaican. Um, black in the middle, right? Okay, and click OK, and I'm going to do this again. So all I'm going to do here, take a sliver, and got to do normal, and straight down. Command C, and new, and Command V. Okay, so I'm going to say for web and devices, it's going to be my BG color. I'll just call it BG. Save. BG. And good. Go back to Dreamweaver. And I'm going to browse. There it is. Choose. We'll repeat the X and apply. And let's go s check it out. Let's see what we got here. 
All right, seems to work. And I'm gonna go ahead and s preview in Safari, yes. All right, that seems to be okay. All right, how are we doing for time? All right, ladies and gentlemen, um, let's continue. I'm pretty sure we're gonna have a third video, but oh, you're gonna do your best. Okay, so let's see what we got for our CSS styles. Okay, let's move on. Let's go to our third, let's go to a header. So we're gonna go ahead and add, and we're gonna do hashtag header. Okay, click okay, and let's just define it right now. So we're gonna do a uh, width of 860, and a height of uh, 60. I'm going to do a background color. Uh, let's go back to the box and let's do auto right, auto left, apply. Okay, and we're going to go ahead and do an, a, a background color. And I'm going to apply that. Again, I'm going with the uh, Jamaican colors. Um, you know what? I'm going to go for sort of neutrality here on the background. All right. And I'm going to use, well, yeah, that's it. Okay. Now, I do have to uh, customize my font here, Usain Bolt Gallery. But the uh, header looks good. I'm going to add another tag here. And it's going to be tag reference. So I'll just do P, not ID. This is just a tag. And I'm going to click OK. So this one is going to affect my header. Remember in the uh, HTML, we put a um, P tag inside there. So I'm going to apply this. And let's see what size we can give it 12, 24. Notice that. Now we have other P tags here, and that's okay. And I'm gonna give it a color of this Jamaican green man. And I'm gonna center the type. So how do I do that? Oh, there's the bell. So I'm gonna go to text align. And let's see. P tag. Okay, box, positioning, hmm, okay, let me pause the video, you right. All right, so what I had to do here was I had to align center. So on this, in the header, you just got to go to your P tag, align center, align equals center in quotes. Um, newer versions of Dreamweaver have a, a totally set of rules um, that make it easier. So unfortunately, we don't have it here, but that's okay. Just the line center, and you'll be fine. All right, I'm gonna have to uh, stop the video. We're running out of time, and I got to go to class. So good luck, and we'll have to, you'll have to resume on Monday. Hope, hopefully, uh, you'll be fine. Actually, I take that back. You'll not be resuming on Monday. You will be going into the final on Wednesday. So uh, um, we'll do our best. Okay. Thanks for watching. Good luck.